Oh, Brian, I can't believe they fired you. How come you never told us you dropped out of college? I, I saw an after-school special about that. It didn't work out too well for Christy McNichol, but then again, nothing did. I was only one course shy of graduating, and I, I just cracked under the pressure. And now it just cost me the best job I ever had. Well, don't take it too hard. You're not the first person to get fired. Look, uh, Louis, the French people really want to thank you for your services as king, but uh, it's just not working out, and we've decided to go another way. So... <laughs> yeah... I just heard the dog got fired. Did I miss it? Did he cry yet? Oh, come on, dog, cry for me. Yeah, there you are. Oh, yeah, cry for Stewie. Life isn't what you thought it would be. Boy, I'll tell you, not graduating from college has haunted me for years. Well, Brian, if you only had one class left, why don't you just go back and finish? Plenty of people do that. You know, Lois, that's not a bad idea. Well, this is boring. Let's go see what Meg is up to. Hello, Meg. Stewie, what the hell are you doing here? Are you kidding? I couldn't miss watching you crash and burn in this misguided attempt to finish college. Look, you're not staying. I'm gonna call Lois and have her pick you up right now. Hi, I'm your roommate, Caleb. I like cutting myself. I bleed a lot. Can I have the top bunk? Uh... He already has a roommate. Me. We're a couple of crazy college kooks. For example, we're about to make a hilarious answering machine message. Uh, you've reached Stewie and Brian. We're not here right now. Uh, and if this is Mom, uh, send money because we're college students and we need money for books and highlighters and ramen noodles and condoms for sexual relations with our classmates. Uh, this is advanced physics, right? Ah! I have a right to defend myself as a woman. No means no! Ah, what the hell is wrong with you? I'm sorry. I just came from that orientation seminar about college dating. Hi, I'm Kelly McGillis, and I'm here to talk to you about rape. Ladies, look to your left. Now look to your right. Statistics indicate that both of those men will rape you. I'm not gonna rape you. I might. Good morning, class. Hey, uh, can I borrow a pencil? Well, well, it looks like we have a comedian. I, I wasn't making a joke, I was just asking. Well, Louis Anderson, our first test is Friday, and if you don't pass, you are out of the class. What do you think, hmm? I got this at the school store. It's an M.C. Escher drawing. I think it's called Crazy Stairs. Look, Stewie, I gotta finish this assignment or I'm gonna fail this class. All done. What? Stewie, I can't use this. It'll be cheating. Oh, fine. Listen, I'll be out on the quad. Do you know what I've discovered about myself since I've been in college? I am so all about ultimate frisbee. <sighs> oh, no. Did that hit crazy stairs? I graded your assignments. Clearly there is only one person here who understands the material. Brian Griffin. <laughs> Just, uh, got lucky, I guess. No, Brian. I underestimated you. Here, let me put a smiley face on your test. May I borrow your pen? Y you uh... Do you, you want me to just... Stick it in there? Yes, 